Okay, hello everyone and welcome back to Daughters of Ash. Listen, I'm gonna have to come clean here. Uh, there is some stuff that is missing from the timeline of me recording this game. As in, I started recording an episode and uh, unfortunately the voice recording ran into some issues. So... I had to scrap around 20 minutes of footage, 25 minutes. The reason that I'm not too mad about it and I'm kind of not trying to salvage it, which probably I could, is that it honestly didn't turn out too well. Uh, earlier today when I was recording, I was just not in a good mood and it really showed in the episode. Uh, I didn't make any progress either. Listen, you missed two things. Those two things are I upgraded the Baldur's side sword to plus seven <coughs> by giving the faded ember to what's his name. The other thing that happened is I killed the Hydra, which was a massive pain in the ass because there's now little minions that spawn when you kill the Hydra or try to kill it. And honestly, I climbed up to Dark Root and I died like twice and I lost all my souls. So that's about all that happened. That's why, you know, like it was basically 25 minutes of nothing. So I, I was just saying, oh, let's just start again. It's a little bit later. I'm in a much better mood. I think it's just the weather, you know. The weather has been all over the place today. And, you know, it's very rare that the weather will affect my mood. Sometimes it does, and today was one of those days. Listen, it was hella sunny and extremely warm and humid yesterday. This morning it was cold and rainy, and then it was just cloudy uh, all throughout the afternoon. And then after lunch it became extremely sunny and hot again. So it's just been like a roller coaster, and yeah, listen, I was just not in the best mood when I was recording and it showed in the commentary I wasn't saying anything interesting bitch you cannot climb up the stairs look at your stupid ass um, and it was just showing you know which sometimes happens you know it's the unavoidable part of uh, making videos and all that you know that's why even on streaming that uh, like I completely understand people, you know, and I think it's a better attitude, you know, to have a stream streaming schedule but not stick to it 100% because inevitably you're going to have days where just, you know, shit hits the fan and it can really be detrimental to a stream when it's like very obvious that you're just not in a good mood. Also, I picked up a couple of items around here. None of them are significant. Uh, the last thing I was working on is I was trying to find a bonfire uh, because my theory is that from what I've seen so far they do not like remove bonfires you know what I mean like if an area had a bonfire before it'll have a bonfire in this version as well but they just kinda relocate them That's my theory, at least. So according to that theory, uh, there should be a bonfire here somewhere. Somewheres, you know. This motherfucker. Oh shit, these dudes respawn, I forgot. Yeah, 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 these are not... Fuck. Only the knight doesn't respawn and what's her, what's her name the archer oh the archer killed herself uh oh this is why I was having trouble before this is why the boy ran into some problems in the last episode it's why the boy boy lost all his souls because of this motherfucker. Oh, and I have my bat controller with me. Why did I hook up this controller?
Jesus Christ, that does so much damage. Does it, like having less HP really make that much of a difference? Because I swear, this is the third time counting the attempts you have not seen that I've died to this enemy. And I don't remember like ever dying to this enemy. Fuck. Um, this is why there was no progress made in the previous or in the scrapped episode as well. I was making an ass of myself. I'm sure there is something. It's this bonfire thing that I'm like really. It's like tickling me. Not in a bad way, you know. Not in a Catholic priest sort of way. But, um, you know. I don't know. Anyways, today is Friday, Big Friday, public holiday in all of Central Europe, May 1st. Shout out to today, three day weekend, it's the dopest. Uh, tomorrow is going to be an interesting day, a big Saturday. Because I'm planning on doing a Twitch stream. First time streaming on Twitch. I'll make like a separate video tomorrow about it as well. Uh, for all of your viewing pleasure. But. Yeah, Twitch. I'm just planning on trying it, you know. We'll see what happens. I still haven't figured out the game that I'm going to be playing. I'm gravitating towards something. Just not sure it's difficult to, you know, pick a first game because you have to keep a balance uh, of like, you know, I don't. I definitely don't want to play a Souls game. You know, with this stream, holy shit, why am I yawning? previous streams that I've done for Souls games um, it's not that I'm burnt out because I'm definitely not burnt out I'm having a ton of fun with this but to play another Souls game alongside this is just not not feeling it uh, I could continue Isaac depending on how interested people are on Binding of Isaac uh, that's one thing I've been thinking of the other thing I've been thinking of is maybe picking up Neo 2. The risk with Neo 2 is, you know, like people want to see it. People have told me that they really want to see it. The risk is that I will have the same issues with it as I had with Neo 1, which people say is pretty much the same game. So, you know, like my big concern is what if it's just. You know, what if I don't like it? Or the other option, of course, option number three is to go for a fighting game. Either more on combat 11 or Street Fighter 5, because those are always good. You know, I feel like those are good streaming games and Isaac as well. Because it's just, you know, you know, I've said this in the Isaac, like, streams as well before, that there's, like, no expectation of, you know, like, it's, there's no story and no, like, anything, you know, it's like a self-contained thing, each run, so if somebody joins in one stream and doesn't join the next, but then joins the one after... It's not like they're missing a lot, you know. So I don't know. I welcome any hot takes in the comments of this video. I'll post on Discord as well. What you guys might want to see. I'm open to ideas.
Because, you know, like, if possible, I would like to grow on Twitch as well. Oh, fuck off. This armor is horrible. Maybe this is the way. Because this has like insane range. The Swag Sword R2. <sighs> oh, so much HP damage. Eat shit, bitch. Definitely don't respawn in this version as well, I hope. Anyways, I'm so glad that guy's dead. I'm very aware that he has a buddy. Where the ass is the bonfire here? Oh, hello. This one is weird. I think this guy's AI is <laughs> like bugged or something. God, this weapon is strong. That range on that R2 is like... Absolutely insane. People were pissed at me that I picked this weapon. Not pissed, but you know. But... When I use it, I gotta say, it feels pretty good to use, you know. Shit, this is bad. I was really, really expecting a bonk fire somewhere. Oh shit, she respawns. I'm... I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble in no. Yeah, I'm in... <laughs> okay, so there is no bonfire here and all the enemies respawn. Which is wonderful. Seriously? I must be like missing some. I must be stoned because there is no way there is no bonfire here. That's such a dick move. If they really pull the take out a complete bonfire thing, that is a dick, dick move. And I just cannot, as I stated before, I cannot fucking stay in human form in this game. Uh, yeah. Fuck it, we'll go with Seath. I'm uh, not Seath, Sif. Get the two confused sometimes. I'll run back, pick up my souls, go kill Sif, and I will just get out of here. It's such a pain in the ass, this run back. Like, seriously. You know, the only thing I'm happy about is, you know, that Sif is an easy boss. I think even with this stage of equipment, I think starting from the bottom, right here, I think this is a quicker... This has to be quicker than running all the way from the top there. So I think we'll rest up here. Oh man, this is exactly why I wanted to scrap the previous episode as well. Because the, it that's all that happened in it. I ran to Darkroot Garden. Well, first, no, 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 no. Let's reiterate. Firstly, I ran to the Hydra, died, ran back. Picked up my souls, died, ran back. Picked up my soul. And then I got up to this area and I died. Ran back, died. And... We are now 15 minutes into this episode. I got my mouse on screen by accident. And we have basically done the exact same thing. Now, of course, the bigger problem is that... If not here, like, where the fuck do we go? I guess we have demon ruins. We have the depths, which the only issue with that is that it's going to be a pain in the ass to get back to it. 
Because I gotta go all the way to Blight Town. And then I gotta ascend. Using our fancy words today. Uh, gotta ascend all the way there. Because of course we have no warping, bonfire warping in this game. Not yet. Of course we don't have the Lord Vessel. Speaking of, again, I could go back to Sense Fortress and do all that shit. But I don't know. I don't know. We'll just get to Sif. You know, it's like whatever. I'm still like, I'm still not in shock, but you know, I'm still weirded out by the fact that they have no bonfire here. It doesn't matter. If the knight responds as well, I'm gonna be so angry. He responds. They made them all respawn. Not just the... Unbelievable. Of course, I could solve all of this by just joining the... Covenant. Speaking of... Maybe that's not such a bad idea. But we like to play risky. Screw it. Mushrooms are still here. The chest is still there. See, now that's interesting. Because 100% guaranteed that doesn't contain the magic ember. Stop jumping. So maybe we'll go exploring once we take care of Sif. What? Grave stalkers? Oh shit, the cat! <gasps> no! Not the cat. Not the fucking cat. I hate these guys. They put... The cats were missing. I, will, I mentioned it in the episode you're not gonna see or video you're not gonna see but the cats were missing and I was like huh weird I'm glad but weird I had a feeling they were gonna pull some shit this is easy though Oh, it's not easy. That's what I was afraid of. I was just about to say, when are they going to start rolling? Is that a real issue with this boss fight? If you fight them... If you fight them, like, normally, they just, like, roll off of the hill. And it's such a pain in the ass. Okay, that was insanely easy. Silver pendant? Okay. You get the silver pendant here? Uh, precious silver pendant from Anor Treasure pendant left by the grave of the Abyss Walker where it was ferociously guarded. Its powerful warm aura appears to naturally repair dark repel <laughs> repair. Pendants like this were once exchanged in wedding ceremonies in Anor Londo, though no name or seal of marriage has yet been engraved on this stone. 
Kieran, where the hell are you? Let's get married. Who am I kidding? Everybody knows Gwendolyn is the one to marry. Guinevere. No, not Gwendolyn. Well, you could marry Gwendolyn. It's all good. But Guinevere and her tatas are where it's at. So I usually got 22,000 souls. So I might be fucking myself by doing this. Blue tight night chunk. That's ho ho ho. The mushrooms are fucked up. Oh. Wait a second. Don't I have a I have a ring of sacrifice. <sighs> I need those 22,000 souls. I don't know why. So we got the silver pendant. Does the same thing. I'm assuming it's still going to be needed for the DLC. Just as always. Yeah, this is going to be kind of a boring run back. I apologize ahead slash in advance. But you know, the thing is back to the earlier topic because it's the topic on my mind, which is Twitch. Um, I guess, you know, listen, obviously the thing is my YouTube stream views are extremely low. Even though my playthrough views, like these types of videos I do, are good. For some reason my stream views, they used to be high. They used to be much higher. And uh, they just like dropped off. I think it's because of all this like Corona shit. I was very, very inconsistent with streaming. Like from middle of February throughout March and a lot of people just dropped off you know that's the thing but still you know I have 13,000 subscribers like getting 20 views even 20 views on stream is just like ridiculously low and it's not, not like I'm complaining you know don't get me wrong it's not that it's just you know a little bit disappointing again when my actual playthroughs most of the time like get good views and I guess that's ki that kind of expectation is just not there on Twitch you know with Twitch I can just focus on almost like a fresh start you know and you know I can still put the VODs here uh, that's not gonna be an issue I can just you know do that just like if I was archiving the stream on YouTube normally but there is still something like the there's still something different about it again probably is just a lack of expectation you know cuz again like having 13,000 subscribers you expect a certain number from yourself you know more like So yeah, that's that's kind of my reasoning. But we'll see, we'll see. Maybe people are just not interested in my ass streaming. Uh, what do I want to do now? What do I want to do? I think we'll leave that area alone for now. I think we've exhausted. Probably not, not exhausted, but we've done what we can there. So I'm guessing like we'll go back to uh, before I thanks hit detection before I uh, accidentally die and break the ring let's remove it I guess we'll go back to Sens and maybe Iron Giant <laughs> Iron Giant Iron Golem Iron Giant is a dope movie though uh, you should watch it don't read the book though the book is bad from what I heard 
It's just I was looking at Ask Reddit in the morning, and one of the threads was like name examples where the movie version of something is better than the actual book or original source material. I didn't even realize that Forrest Gump was a book as well, but it really is. Good for them. I've seen... I like that movie, Forrest Gump. Kai, what am I talking about? Like, talking about Forrest Gump on this stream? Yeah, not, and I just said stream, so I don't even know what medium of gameplay broadcasting I'm in. But yeah, Forrest Gump is good. Classic. And of course there's Weird Al's parody, where he parodies Lump by Presidents of the United States. And the lyrics are Gump related. It's a pretty good one. Okay, just thank you. This makes my life a lot easier. That was a galaxy brain move by that thing. And I didn't even like I didn't even process or talk about the fact that we technically fought another new boss. Grave stalkers. I always found that though that that was a wasted enemy. Those cats. Because they're fairly challenging and all that. And it's weird that they kind of just hide them in a corner. And honestly a lot of players never even experienced a fight with them. I haven't fought them if fuck knows how long. You know what? Let's attune that. Or equip it. I am like super sans iron golem. Okay. Ouch. I got hadokened. Interesting. Uh oh. Shit. He's strong. And I didn't hit the bonfire, did I? Okay, they made this dude stronger. Yeah. I did screw up by not hitting the bonfire. I will admit. That was a little bit overconfident on my part. I really should have a plus 10 weapon for this though. It's all good. Yeah, plus 10 weapon and all that, but yeah. I can beat him, I think. I mean, will I have time though? That's the question. Are we up to the half hour mark already? Screw it. I'll give this boss one more try. Just one more quick, quick attempt. Hell yeah. That's how you zigzag, boys. So he, ha he now has AoEs on his axe attacks. That's, I think, the... Oh, shit. That's annoying. Cool. Heal up. Use this. 
These things don't last too long. And I just realized I haven't used my... Fuck! Are, are you kidding me? I cannot... Okay. They may this change something about this thing. First things first, I'm pretty sure his footsteps or his movement did not use to deal damage. Ah, god damn it. This is fucked up. I didn't pick up my souls. This is this is fucked up. Uh I'm not sure I'm strong enough. I don't have a plus you really need a plus ten weapon for this. The issue is that this means I think that the way forward is through the fucking depths. Which means that I gotta backtrack from here all the way down to Blighttown. And all the way up back to the depths, which is going to be a massive pain in the ass. I'm going to do it. By next time, we'll, we'll meet there. Because, like, this dude is strong. Like, the fact that he one-shots me, I think, is evidence enough that uh, this is a bigger hurdle in this game, this guy. Plus, I was, like, doing no damage to him. Yeah, we'll wrap it up here. Thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And make sure to like, comment, subscribe. You know, Twitch streaming, what game would you like to see? Let me know. We'll wrap it up here. Peace out.